because today is the first day of school and we have a doctorate again. I'm getting here early because I need to read for the section, so. But since I'm here, might as well show you what one of our classrooms look like. So let me back up. This is the projector. This is the front of the classroom. He has a whiteboard. They have whiteboards that they'll write on sometimes or go over certain material that's not on their PowerPoint. And then this is the classroom. So since I'm early, like I told you guys, I need to go over, and I kind of went over it yesterday. Bring it down to a level. One second. Okay, y'all. So I'm sitting here about to go over this stuff. Like I was saying, I did most of it last night. I need some lotion because this ain't even okay. Should I run home and get some lotion, y'all? Because I'm not. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Another reason why I sit in the front. If I like the teacher, I'm gonna sit in the front. Does, is that weird? Cause I feel like I rock with you, we here with it. I'm not gonna sit in the back. No, because we rock. I understand how you're teaching. I understand your flow. So I'm going to give myself a better opportunity by sitting in the front and just looking forward. So another reason why I like to sit in the front in um, my lectures. And honestly, I'm that person that if I don't sit in the front, I'll be looking at everybody else's computer. Because if you look at it, I'll be up there. That means everybody else is in front of me. Oh, I'm distracted. I'm distracted. So... We're not doing that this try. Discipline. So it is now about two o'clock-ish. I just finished like the first half of my day. I went out and ran some errands. If you guys can tell, she's a singing girl. She's a singing girl. A vision girl. <laughs> but I can finally see again i am so excited these are my case spades i've had these for years now let's bring that back so i've had these for a couple years now i think they're so like sleek these are more like the cat eyes they give you more like mm, mm. okay so i just finished my first day of the new try and it went well it went really well. Um, right now I'm making dinner and then I'm about to study. I need to create a good schedule for myself so I can keep track of what days work on this, what days go and spend some time, you know, doing things that I like to do, et cetera, et cetera. So I'm just figuring out that schedule um, today and I'm gonna read over the material that we went over today and I'm gonna get try to get a head start on tomorrow. So, Hello beautiful people. So right now I am on my way out. What you think is the makeup hitting? I know. Hi. Okay. Does this look good? Do I look good? Do I look good? So cool. <laughs> you got this one at the other fan. This is so funny. I feel it though. It's like this is so me if I was a reindeer please catch me at the water fan because <laughs> I know it feels good y'all 
So I just got done at the zoo. I had mad fun. And I said, let me walk to a local bar to see what the food is like. So I walked from the zoo to a local bar and I'm excited. So let's see. Oh, and I'm gonna show you guys my nails. It's kind of like cow, but brown. So brown cow, brown cow. Oh, I wanted you guys to see this. The therapeutic order. Live by it, breathe by it, know it, show it, grow it. <laughs> but grab some scrap paper because one of my glasses, like if you're not scrap papering, you're not you're you're just you're not retrieving the information. so beautiful outside like the lake is so nice it's called Lake Jancy so beautiful hello again hello, hello. so I just came from the printer going to go get my book bag because I don't have glass went to the library again to print out some stuff um, yeah. one thing really noticed is when you're learning this material at this level it's all about repeating retrieval method one of my teachers loves talking about this but it's all about repeating the same thing over and over again you know you you basically photo dump what you know on each topic and then you refine it edit it see what you already know what you don't know what you need to work on work on that come back so it's it's an everyday process it's not like a this is not undergrad. You have to do this every single day. You have to be committed to like taking in the information every single day. And this one particular teacher, she's very good about literally, she, she has like lab objectives where she tells you what slides, what pictures, what topics are gonna be on the quiz, are gonna be on the exam. So like you literally have to take each little bulletin and just make sure you know how to recognize those things under different views, electromagnetic view, or like a high dive view, low dive view, all these ways. And this is a biology class. So when I talk about um, dyes and stuff, I'm talking about looking at biological, um, looking at biological organisms. <laughs> I can't really think about the word, but looking at biology under a microscope. When you use a dye, like a stain or a dye, it helps to view that organism or view that thing under the microscope better. So that's what I mean. And we have to know, um, not necessarily what dyes are being used, but like what something may look like under multiple dyes. And she tells you, and she gives you websites to help you figure it out. So it's really, really cool. I really, really like that. And then I have my own little <laughs> things in my little corner that I'm gonna so that's really exciting. I love that. Love that. I love you guys. I, I haven't like necessarily came on here and said that, but I literally love all a hundred and about 50 of you guys that follow me, that watch my content, that are interested in my content and my growth. And it's just so cool connecting with you guys and all the people that do interact or just tell me about the stories of them wanting to go to naturopathic school or going to naturopathic school. It literally motivates me. And I'm just so, I'm just so thankful. So thank you guys. I love y'all.
and it's crazy because I really do love you guys like I love hearing the positivity and the motivation and like I just love you guys I love how you guys are into natural medicine you see the beauty of it you want to do the same thing I'm doing and I encourage you guys to do the same thing I'm doing and more you know you can tap into any field with this specialty so Good morning. Good morning. Hello, hello. I am on my way to an acupuncture appointment. I have a goal today. Today I am recording the whole thing. We're talking about it, we're being about it. So yeah, I'm excited. Let's go. And also I was thinking like, um, like I was like looking at all the online assignments that I'm doing and that was on my little school website and I just started thinking about how like dang like sometimes like the online classes or like the classes that you don't have to necessarily go into those those be the one that be the hardest to keep up with the work is like it's very nice I really like it it's like more of a clinical pace it's more of a clinical pace so it feels like you know you're actually doing stuff that is related to like what you're going to be doing in clinic but sometimes it can be so tedious so it's like oh I forgot I had that assignment it's like you know because it's online or because you don't go into that class you don't necessarily think about it well I don't necessarily think about it 24 7 so and I have like a couple of kind of they call them like online classes or remote classes. I have a couple of those this try. So I'm like, ooh, girl, stay on top of it because I do not be, I do not be wanting to email people like, oh, can I try to submit? No, we're past that, we're wrong. I'm so geeky. Why am I geeky? Because I'm a bitch. What's poppin'? Who you a Brand new whip just hopped in. Okay, so I am out of clinic, but <laughs> but I'm gonna be going back later to get the second part of my service done, which is cupping. I just got the acupuncture this morning. And then I plan on getting some herbs and he's gonna give me probably a tincture, but just some organic base treatments for my menstrual cramping and eye care so isn't that so cute look at them <laughs> what's happening okay transversion of that okay pisiform with torque all right you're doing this in slow motion too nice 